as we know, Dassault Aviation, a French company, has currently optimized the results of the development of combat drones, which were carried out in the experimental project of Dassault Neuron. Although the name Neuron sounds unfamiliar, however, at first glance this unmanned vehicle is very similar, with a US-made stealth-designed reconnaissance drone, the RQ-170 Sentinel. The Neuron aircraft first made a flight in France in December 2012. The aircraft is designed to create autonomous drones and long-range pilots with stealth capabilities and can serve to carry out a variety of mission and operational scenarios in combat zones in the face of medium and high threats. Please note, the development of Neuron was originally planned by Dassault as the AVE Grand Duck. Then, it was developed in cooperation with various other European countries, including Sweden, namely the company, Saab AB. Then there was Hellenic Aerospace Industry in Greece, Ruag Aerospace in Switzerland, Eid Ies Casa in Spain, and Alenia, now Leonardo Finmeccanica, in Italy. However, the project, the French company Dassault, remains as the main contractor, as a technology demonstrator, only one type of vehicle has been produced to explore new operational concepts, of course for future generations as an advanced autonomous stealth military fighter. Known as stealth drones, this Neuron unmanned vehicle has several roles, which are expected to carry out war missions in the future. In conducting autonomous flights, Neuron, which is equipped with Delta wings, can take off and land automatically, allowing it to operate faster and more effectively. When flying, it can also operate in a network-centric environment, such as receiving and transmitting data over high-speed, low-speed data links to ground control stations as well as to other aircraft. In addition, Neuron has advanced features including EO and IR sensors, so it can conduct reconnaissance and target attacks without being seen by the enemy during flight. As for other features, it is equipped with a global monitoring and control system, which integrates with other systems during operation so that it is more effective. For its main propulsion, the Neuron uses a Rolls-Royce engine, Turbomeca Dua MK951 hybrid, producing a high subsonic speed of around Mach 0.7 to 0.8, or can glide at a maximum speed of 980 km per hour, and is able to fly up to an altitude of 14,000 meters. The speed and range, which the drone has, can maintain flight for several hours, making it suitable for extended mission operations. In fact, Neuron is also capable of controlling squad flights in automatic mode with other fighters, such as the Advanced Platform Rafale or Jazz 39 Gripen. In this case, the French manufacturer stated that the Edoua Neuron engine, adapted from the version used in Seepcat Jaguar, will later be replaced in a production version with a more powerful engine, and specific to the M88 Snecma from Dassault Rafale. The advantage of the stealth design of the Neuron when used in close-range operations or on the front line will not be detected by enemy defense systems because the aircraft has a high speed and reduces radar or infrared signatures even when operating in high-threat environments. Although without pilot control, the Neuron can carry out air-to-ground missions with its arsenal capable of launching precision-guided munitions from two internal weapon bays housed in the weapon bay to two guided bomb units weighing 230 kilograms each. The bomb uses semi-active laser guidance to track targets illuminated by separate sources, thus hitting direct targets almost 60% of the accuracy time which is much higher than unguided bombs, which only have an accuracy rate of 5.5% per mission.
If you notice, the shape of the Neuron military aircraft is indeed interesting, with dimensions that have a length of 10 meters, a width of 12 meters, and a weight of 5 tons. This is roughly the size of a Mirage 2000 fighter, which is rotated 90 degrees because Neuron is wider than it is long. On February 9, 2006, the Swedish company Saab had previously noted that the aircraft was converted into a smaller demonstration of single-engine technology. Thus, the aircraft is now optimized for testing various technologies for future UAVS and UCAVS and will not enter serial production. Therefore, the presence of Neuron is inseparable from the support of industry partners. Because, so far they have invested more in technology development, rather than producing hardware and other flying weapons, despite the risk of losing a single prototype. On the other hand, the Neuron project also provides European companies with experience, designing and building high-end unmanned vehicles and related technologies in order to keep them competitive in the global market. As we know, this project is the final stage of the French Dassault Logeduc three-stage stealth fighter drone program. As for the shape of the Neuron drone, it is almost similar to the Grand Duck vehicle, which was also developed by Dassault earlier as a long-range, supersonic twin-engine unmanned bomber capable of carrying out attacks with nuclear weapons.